Well, a fancy restaurant in West Hollywood, famous for its expensive food and celebrity sightings, is being accused tonight of serving up reheated dishes. KCONLINE's Brittany Hopper looks at the culinary controversy. Fig and Olive, a place where many go for its trendy ambiance, expensive drinks, and fresh food, is being accused of making some of their dishes in a commissary in New York, then shipping it to LA and reheating it before serving to their customers. It's definitely shocking. Uh, Fig and Olive is a high end, gourmet, uh, expensive restaurant. Matthew Kang is an editor and writer for Eater Los Angeles. He's been writing about the story since it broke after the restaurant chain was linked to dozens of cases of salmonella poisoning. He says they reheat certain dishes on the stove that's been made by someone else in a commissary. The swanky restaurant has eight locations throughout the country, including ones in West Hollywood and Newport Beach. From a diner point of view, th that's not what we want to see. Like when you go into a place and you're spending $100 a person, you want to get the sense that, hey, like real people are making this food. It's real food that's made from local farms or from high quality ingredients. But Kang says more restaurants operate this way than we might think. It cuts costs down and helps when serving hundreds of people nightly. But they may not be charging $26 for a truffle risotto. Fig and Olive did give us a statement saying, We had a commissary that was utilized for specific items by our New York outposts and selectively nationwide, which we closed in September 2015. The vast majority of ingredients served at our restaurants are locally sourced from vendors and farms. Currently, all of our dishes are prepared in house at each location. In West Hollywood, Brittany Hopper, KCAL 9 News.